I'm not sure what you're asking, Bastia. Yeah, I really don't talk to any of my siblings anymore. Jacqueline, I did get some, and anything else that I do get will just go right to the same thing so that I can get everything that I need while I'm out. Um, D Mama, I'm just needing help with when I go out tomorrow for my appointment. I need to get some personal items and um, some groceries to get me through until Friday. I'm missing the food pantry tomorrow. So I don't have that option, unfortunately. Oh, really? Uh, unicorn, because I'm in remission for bone cancer, I had Ewan sarcoma in 2015. Oh, really? That's kind of funny. He started out in, he graduated in Texas, um, San Antonio. And then he was stationed in Valdosta, Georgia. And then he went to Dayton, Ohio. And now he's in North Carolina. Um, living my best life. Since I've been in remission, this is the first time they've called me to come in for my results. I'm starting to think so, Rick, for real. Um, I'm not sure yet. I have to go in tomorrow at 10. Hi, Marsha. How are you? Yes, Jennifer. On Friday, I get my December check. The other two... No, I have nothing left for Thanksgiving, Allie. Um, Kel, I do have that, and it's going all to that, um, it's going to the personal care items and whatnot, um, I have $40 from earlier, and, you know, whatever I'm able to get from this point will go towards more groceries, because it's sad, but $40 doesn't even get you a whole lot anymore these days, especially when you're buying other items that's so expensive um, Sheila honestly is it I'm grateful for what I do have gotten and like I said I got $40 earlier and I'm grateful for anything more that I get um, that way I'm able to get everything that I need. It's prices are ridiculous as most of you probably know and I just want to be able to get everything I need so I don't have to go back out. But I mean if anyone's able to help with anything, um, like I said I have $40 to go towards it and unfortunately just the female items alone is going to be like $15, $16. So, I don't know. It's frustrating. But if anyone can or is able to send anything, my CA is right here. PayPal and Venmo in my bio. Anything helps. Lotus, I do so many survey apps and the first time that you're going to cash out is great, it helps, but it just takes forever after that. If I had a dollar store that was accessible to me, I would go, Mary. Hey, Shannon, I'm taking care of myself right now. I'm helping my mental health by showing you the exit, baby.
roach if I had a target that would be an awesome deal unfortunately Danielle I'm probably I mean I know it's ridiculous for me not to have a goal I would say if I could get like 20 more dollars I, don't, I mean I really don't want to be greedy I don't want to be I'm grateful for what I do have but 20 more dollars would I wish I could cash out my gifts that would be awesome thank you Tina Tina but yeah 20 more dollars I could get all the groceries and the personal items and that way I'll have 60 total to go and get everything I need so yeah if I can get 20 more if I can't I can't Lanya 20 more would help um, Joan I I'm in remission for cancer Personal items are very expensive, Christy, and that's why I'm still asking, you know, if it's possible to get more help, then great, awesome. You know, if I can't, I can't, but personal items are ridiculously expensive. Um, yep, and I just said that I made my $40, but if I can get anything extra, then I'm grateful. And Lestina, they aren't required to post your results until after they're signed off on. And my doctor has not signed off on them. They're still pending. So they're, if I had a Dollar Tree, I would. I get $15 a month for food stamps. Barbara, yes, I have my taxi money. Um, Kaylee, I need the female personal items. And I need a few groceries. Um, Maury, I wish I could get a job. I would love to be working again. You have no idea. G like twenty dollars would help and get so I can get everything that I need. I only made four muffins, Jennifer. Um, Jennifer, the OTC benefit card is good for groceries, not all groceries. They're very particular on which ones they cover, and they don't cover all personal items. Um, smoking, laughing, 420. I don't look and waste my time on the snark pages because I could even go on and make a mixture of videos and make other people look bad and kick them while they're already down in a bad time of their life. It doesn't take an idiot to make a video like that. So, yeah, I'm not going to waste my time while they waste theirs. Um, they really don't cover pads. I promise you that. If I had a Dollar Tree, I would. Thank you, Sky. Um, I didn't say it was anybody else's responsibility. I'm grateful for the help that I do get, though. Um, I'm not able to go to the food pantry, Deb, tomorrow because I have to go to my doctor's appointment. Thing, Javi. I utilize all my resources, the little bit that we have. Yeah, I have United Healthcare and it does not cover my pads. Um, see why I am taking the bus to Biddeford, then I'm taking the taxi from Biddeford to Portland. I get $15 a month for food stamps. Lynette, they for sure don't. Um, I've called 211. One thing I'm going to put out there, and I'm not sure why people insist that they're correct, but not every place 
has the same resources available. Smaller places have less resources than bigger places. And I've had a lot of people verify that Maine, the southern part of Maine where I am, has very little resources. Um, yeah, I do know they do cover transportation, but you have to have 48 hour notice and I didn't have a 48 hour business notice. Um, the Dollar Tree store is 15 minutes away driving and the bus doesn't go that way and I'm not going that way tomorrow. Yep, Sanford Plaza is out of town, Jen. If you knew, you would know. Yeah, I know where Dollar Tree is. I don't need you guys to make up a map and show me. I'm telling you, it takes 15 minutes to drive there. I don't have a way to get there. That's funny because OTC doesn't cover all women products. Yeah, I do have an Amazon wish list. They don't have Ubers here, guys. Think about it. I'm in a small place. They don't have Ubers. But yeah, I mean, I did get $40 earlier. I'm sure you do. And I'm sure if I said that I lived in Sanford, Florida, you would live there too. I can't do a Walmart pickup. I don't have a way to get there. They're not excuses. I've just answered these questions so many times. Jennifer, I'm just going to breathe. I'm going to breathe. You can't fix stupid. DD, I'm just coming on because I ended the live abruptly and I'm just saying, you know, if I could get 20 more dollars because female items are very expensive. Yeah. I appreciate your kindness, Holly, honestly. I need like 20 more dollars if I can get it. If not, I will figure it out with $40. Melissa, I did move, so you can move on out of here. I'm not dealing very kindly with ignorance or people who think they know my life better than I do. Oh, simply, simply, what am I going to do? Yeah, Sarah, I'm not giving out my address. I'm sorry. Nothing against you personally, but I'm not. We are trying to contact Crystal regarding her water bill since you are her twin in many ways. I'm not sure who Crystal is, so you might want to try somebody else, weirdo. Like, why do people go to such limits just to be weird? Um, Summer Moon, that was back when I stole food for my kids because I was going through a really shitty time in my life. I've taken accountability for that. That was back in 2016, 2070. So take your shit and move on out because I'm fucking over it. I'm over it. I'm done seeing the bullshit. I know what I've done in my past. I don't need people who don't even know me looking it up on fucking Google and printing it on here. Get a fucking life. I'm over it. So fucking over it. Yeah, see the thing with samples, honey, is they take time to come in the mail and I need them like yesterday. My day's been okay, just a little stressed out. Thanksgiving was amazing. It was freaking amazing. I'm um, 30 to 50. I am on my way 
to my appointment tomorrow, I'm going to be stopping and getting, well, probably on the way back, I'm going to try to pick up what I need for groceries and my personal items. Um, God, I can't read that. Nandy, I'm not using a washcloth, I'm sorry. If I had a washing machine in my house, I would, but no, I don't. You cannot get past with OTC card. Um, gee, I need like 20 more dollars if I can get it. And the, fem the female items isn't the only thing I'm getting. I'm also trying to pick up enough groceries to get me through until Friday. But the female pads and tampons, I'm not going to be able to get them, both of them together for less than $16. The shit's expensive, I'm sorry. Um, I do have wash rags, but I don't have a washer or dryer accessible that I don't have to pay for. So that, I'm not letting them sit here for God knows how long. Whatever store I can get to on the way back, I'm probably going to go to Hannaford. Exactly, Heather, and I will if I have to. Um, and Katie, I am putting up my Amazon wish list tonight. Carmen, very few people show me kindness, and I'm human and I have feelings. Sorry. I got $40 earlier, Susie Johnson. So if you're going to keep track of somebody else's life, you might want to make sure you're more factual. Um, YNA, I have to wait until I have money to do my laundry or I have to do it by hand. Oh, I've, I've actually put laundry in my bathtub recently because I wasn't able to do my laundry. Erica, they are. I don't know where you're from. No, it... It's because, okay, Lestia, Lestia what, I'm sorry if I can, I'm not pronouncing that right. Why are you confused about my appointment? My doctor called, said I needed to come in first thing Monday morning. Cut and dry. What's so hard about understanding that, hon? Shannon, that's correct. If you type my name into your search bar, you're going to see a bunch of videos of people posted about me, making fun of me, kicking me when I'm already down, because I'm going through a hard time, okay? Going through a really hard freaking time. And I'm sorry if I inconvenience you in your time. You don't have to stay in here. Scroll out. OTC does not pay for hygiene products. I wish the hell they did, but they don't. And I don't have OTC right now. I'm completely out. I can't do pickup at Walmart, honey. I'm sorry. Yes, PJ. I plan on staying on TikTok for the rest of my life and begging people for money and going through this mental abuse every freaking day because it just tickles my fancy. That's exactly what I plan on doing for the rest of my life. Come on, really? No, he hasn't signed off on the results yet because he won't sign off until I'm in the office.
Oh, I've seen tons of lovely videos that people have taken so much time out of their personal lives to make and sitting there and trying to say that I'm lying about this, lying about that, putting all these videos together, but they're putting things together from seven years ago, you know, up to a couple days ago. I can do that too. Um, Katie, no, I'm not ignoring you, but I'm not giving out my address. I've done that before. I know Walmart delivers. I've had them deliver. I'm not ignoring anybody. I will not give out my address. I haven't been doing this for seven years. I just started having to ask for help from strangers in July because I started having a financial, like, I don't want to say crisis, but financial stress. And it's been the domino effect ever since. Ever since the first time I came on here and asked for help. I don't do this every day and every night, but you can leave too. You guys are making this easy for me to block people. How about we do it this way, class? Everyone who's a hater, who's ignorant and thinks they know me better than I know myself, raise your hand and I'll gladly block you right now. Riley, it was a scan that I get every six months to check for if there's any more growth for cancer. It shouldn't be red flags, Kathleen, because unfortunately I've had to learn my lesson on here the only reason I'll get gift cards. I posted my email address. That's the only thing I'm posting personal of mine. I've given my phone number out before when I needed help paying for my phone bill. It was plastered everywhere. I got prank phone calls all hours of the night, all hours of the day. I gave my address to somebody who's going to do a delivery. Never did the delivery, but has very nicely sent pizza, not paid for, but pizza deliveries to my house numerous amounts of time has sent the cops to my house several times. I'm not doing it, okay? Respect my wishes and I respect yours. A taxi to Wally World would probably be about $15 one way. So you can also send me $30 for the taxi. That's the thing, main lady, oh, main lady. I've already gone to the town hall. They only help once a year. I've already used that resource. I've gone to churches, filled out the benevolence fund application. Use that one. Pantry I have to miss tomorrow because I have to go to my appointment. Paula, I'm not able to physically work because I had bone cancer. I have a hole in my hip and a hole in my pelvis. My bones are brittle, very weak. I can't sit, stand, or walk for long periods of time. I'm disabled. I'm waiting for my check on Friday. If you don't care, just leave. Yes, I've given my address and they sent me unpaid pizza deliveries. I don't refuse to use resources, so stop lying to people. I use the resources that I can and that I have. Yeah, I'm not going to use a menstrual cup. I have some, I, I can't do that, sorry. I will not use a menstrual cup. There's something about that I can't stomach. I'm sorry. I still have the money from earlier, yes. 
Yes, my the pads are on my Amazon list. I have not gotten my past two checks yet. Okay, I'm going to say this one more time for all the people in the back. Yes, I was on here earlier. I came back on because I left abruptly. And all I'm saying is if I'm able to get $20 more, I get what I need. I didn't say my period was anybody's problem. You don't have to be here. Just keep moving, okay? Um, T okay. The only thing about that is I've had my period now for two and a half weeks straight. I didn't plan for that, okay? I'm going through premenopause. I'm going through a lot, okay? That's not the only thing I need. I'm happy, Nana. I have enough for the taxi. I have enough to get a few groceries. Yes, I'm grateful for what I have. I'm just trying, if I'm able to get 20 more dollars, I'm grateful. I'm just, I'm not giving out my address. Caroline, I'm needing it so that when I go to my appointment tomorrow, I can stop at the store and get the groceries I need until Friday, because that's when I get my check. And then, also I need a few female items, which is ridiculously expensive. I get $15 a month for food stamps. Caroline, I have, C if anyone can help with anything, my CA's right here, PayPal and Venmo are in my bio. I'm sure she heard me when I told her, okay? I'm not hiding that. Yes, I get $15 a month for food stamps. Thank you, Shannon. Or Sharonda, sorry. Captain, I don't know. You Please, if you know the answer, let me know. Because you know what? My mother who's elderly, who also gets Social Security, she gets $19 a month for food stamps. So you tell me. Oh, really, Joyce? Okay, I'm sorry you feel that way. Tracy, I wish I could, but the bus doesn't go by there on the way back or their way there. I'm telling you, some of these people, some worth. $15 is BS. You know what? I wish you guys wrote the state of Maine, whatever they use, to figure out how much food stamps you get. It's Maine. But if anyone can help out with anything, anything will go towards when I go shopping tomorrow after my appointment. Um, my CA's right here, PayPal, them or my bio, anything helps. Yes, Mindy, I did. I'm, I'm, nobody is being forced to help me. Nobody is being told to help me. Nobody's being bullied to help me. If they want to help me, they're going to help me from their heart. Yes, I did do radiation.
Thank you, Martha. Jen, it doesn't matter if it's from their bank account. If they want to help me, they will help me from their heart. I'm not making anybody help me. My wish list should be in my profile unless people got them taken down. I got 15 months of chemotherapy back when I, in 2015. Last week I did it the same way I'm doing it tomorrow. Melanie, I'm taking the bus from here to Biddeford and then a taxi from Biddeford to Portland and then other way around on the way home. I can't pick it up on the way home, Cherie, because Walmart isn't on the way home. I have to take a bus. I have no car, so I can't. No, I'm just happy, Nana. I'm just coming back on because I had to regroup myself after dealing with a lot of really mean people. And I got to thinking... Stuff is so expensive. It's crazy. I'm not going to... $40 isn't going to go far. I'm grateful. I'm so grateful for $40 that I got. But, yeah. You know, if I can get more, that's where it's going to go. Just so I can go get what I need until Friday. But Dana, it doesn't stop your cycle for the rest of your life, honey. Renee, it doesn't put you in permanent, I'm not even, I'm not doing this, not doing this. I don't have to validate my period to you guys, okay? Well, I'm glad, congratulations, I have $40 so far, pink. Kales, I know it is, I know it's expensive for other people, okay, I get it. Oh my fuck. I haven't taken chemotherapy since 2016, okay? I haven't gotten 98. I'm sorry, Kelly. Kelly, I got $40 last night. It's for the taxi. And then I got $40 earlier today. And I still have all that because that's going to be for the groceries. Susan, motherfucker. I can't make the bus stop at Walmart in Bitterford because when it goes, it goes. There's only three trips from Bitterford to Sanford, okay, darling? I can't say, oh, hold on, I got to stop at Walmart. I'll be right back out. It doesn't work that way, honey. I was di okay, I don't even know why I'm dealing with this right now. I was diagnosed very short history about Amanda Bowden. I was diagnosed in 2015. I did 15 months of chemotherapy and two rounds of radiation. I ended chemotherapy in 2016. My pupils are in your belly button. I'm not getting mad. I'm getting mad because people are just ignorant and arrogant. I can't stand it. Don't be in here if you're going to hate and be mean. Um, Chelsea, maybe you weren't in here, honey, but Medicare, I, Moby Care is what they use up here for Medicare transportation. They, thank you, Debbie. They require that you give a 48 hour business hour notice to schedule a ride perfectly imperfect I'm needing anything helps so I can go grocery shopping while I'm out for my doctor's appointment tomorrow I'm needing personal care items I'm needing just enough to get me through until Friday 
Negrita, I don't think anyone realizes that. You know, there's a light on the phone. When you go closer, your pupils get really small. Pretty cool fun fact, huh? Michelle, I'm taking both. I'm taking a bus from my home to Bitterford, and then from Bitterford to Portland, I have to take a taxi. I'm tweaking for it now. Why are you still here, talk? You're ignorant, too. I don't want ignorant people in here, okay? Um, I'm sure you could give him a call. Go over there and message him on his TikTok, because I can't help you there, babe. I wish I could ride a bicycle skull. I wish I could be normal. Hey, Kelly, guess what? My phone is covered. And I don't sit on it all day. If anyone can help, Grace, I can't work. I'm in on disability. I'm waiting for my check to come on Friday. I haven't had a check since September, okay? I'm just needing help getting a few groceries until Friday. And I need female items. So far, I've got $40. And I'm just needing help. Anything helps at this point. I don't need to be... Yeah, I do block people. Because you know why? I'm going to block people... TWTW, why? Why would you even say that? No, I don't need a dentist, thank you. I lost that tooth during chemotherapy because it makes your teeth soft. So gladly see your way out. Oh, my freaking head. Here for it all. Walmart's not on the bus route to go to Bitterford. Okay, number one. No, I'm blocking the ones that are ignorant. I'm blocking the ones that don't understand reality. I'm blocking the people who think they know me better than I know me. Dana, I'm not taking an Uber. I'm taking a taxi. And taxis don't take payment over the phone. I haven't used the excuse of my period at all this month, so people need to learn to keep track of me better. I'm kind of offended. Absolutely, Tammy. Chemo can kill your teeth. And Kales, if people paid enough attention or as much attention as they seem to want to pretend they do, they would see that I do. I do so much for myself. When I got back into this town, I walked to hell and high water just to do what resources were available. Resources aren't that big down here. There is not that many resources. I filled out the applications with the churches. I have gone to the town hall. I can't get any more help from the town hall this year. So for people to say that I'm not helping myself, they can kindly go away. Just keep scrolling. I don't need it. I moved here because it's supposed to be more convenient. The bus picks up right out front of my house. They drop off out front of my house. It's very exhausting. And I'm sorry if I... The credit card, uh, the taxi company does not take credit card payments over the phone. Stacy, I have called on live and verified that. I'm sorry you missed that, darling. Oh, Caroline, sometimes I wish I did because I bet the people are way nicer there than here. Tracy, it's not an attitude. It's called I'm human and I have free, I have feelings. They keep offering a pickup order. Yes, I can't pick up. Okay. 
I'm taking a taxi halfway. And green apple, the majority of the time, I don't have to take a taxi. This is once in a blue moon type of thing. I didn't plan on having to go back to the doctor. I didn't schedule this. The, the taxis, can I walk to Walmart, Tina? No, I can't. Walmart is 20 minutes away from where I live. The bus doesn't go there. Amen, Tammy. I know I don't. I'm just... And I'm sorry. I'm only going to say this one more time for the people who didn't hear me. I don't give out my address for deliveries because I've learned my lesson the hard way. I don't give out my phone number because I've learned the lesson the hard way. I'm trying to protect my privacy. I can't do pickups because I don't have a vehicle. I have to rely solely on the bus. Okay? And the bus that I'm taking tomorrow goes straight up 111. That's it. There's not a whole hell of a lot on 111. And you cannot ask the bus to stop and come back and get you. Because this bus only does three trips a day that way and back. So that's how I can explain that. And I'm sorry if I want to buy my own personal items. I'm sorry. Oh my God, Audrey. Let's put your listening ears on baby cakes, okay? I just said I'm taking a bus. For, number one, I'm taking a bus from here halfway. And then I'm taking a taxi for the rest of the way. So I'm doing half and half. Do we understand now? I can't do a pickup because I don't have a car. I get my check on Friday, fly high. Dana, a taxi will charge me an extra $5 for any stops on the way. Thank you, Martha. I just need anything helps. Um, like I said, I could use twenty more dollars just to make sure I get everything that I need. But I mean, I don't know what store I'm going to. I don't know. I have to figure it out when I go. It might not be until I get back from the doctor's appointment. I might have to go to Hannaford. I don't know what's going on. I just know that I need to go to the store. I need to get stuff miss true because they charge extra for any stops and I don't have that kind of leniency Drea there's no uber that's going to do that I'm sorry oh my god Thank you for the penny for the lie detector test. What the fuck is wrong with people? <laughs> I'm getting groceries. I am planning on when I get back into town, go into the local grocery store, which is Hannaford. I don't have any family, Sarah. That's fine. I respect that you don't want to give cash, Michelle. Respect that I don't want to give personal information. Easy. Two-way street, then scroll, okay? Coffee lover. Okay, I'm not going through this again. Sandy, I got taxi money yesterday, correct. Earlier today, I got... Sorry, $39. For personal items, which $15 is going to be a chunk of that, and then a few groceries. Things aren't expensive. Things are expensive. I'm sorry. I mean, if I can get it, great. If I can't, I'm not rescheduling. I'm sorry. I'm not going through that one again. But if anyone can help with anything, it will all go towards groceries tomorrow. My CA's right here. PayPal and Venmo in my bio. Anything helps. Anything helps. 
Why don't you just get... Don't be telling people to shut up in here. West Panic, you can keep going, okay? Veggie, I haven't seen him in months, so no. Why does people feel the urge to send a penny with a horrible fucking message? <laughs> I'm not trying to be rude to anybody, and I apologize for being rude to anyone who's being nice. But people sending messages on PayPal, that's fucked up shit. Jen, I'm needing it for a few groceries to get me through until Friday when I get my check. And I need some of it to go towards a few personal items. Perfectly imperfect. If you were going to help, you would have helped, okay? I haven't said or done anything wrong to you. But I shouldn't have to take this, okay? ADT, it's not about budgeting. I haven't gotten a check since September 1st. It was $920. Could you have made that last three months while well, maintaining life? I bet you couldn't. It's not again, it's been ongoing. I don't... I'm from Maine. <laughs> Lisa, the difference is, is I can't do a pickup order because I can't. I don't have a car. I can't physically get there. A taxi is going to charge me more. I don't have that kind of room to spend more. I have exactly what I need for the taxi. I have exactly what I need for personal care items and a few groceries. I don't have the room to make stops. And I'm not even upset about, like, if I'm able to get some more so I can get what I need, I'm going to be forever grateful so I don't have to keep on freaking asking between now and Friday. Okay, Heather, $80 would normally last me a week too, but 40 of that has to go towards a taxi, okay? All right, you guys don't have to be here, okay? Don't be here. If I want to cry, I'm going to cry, Danielle. So you don't have to be here either. Life with four, it's 17 one way. Jason Farnham, stop, please. You're being really mean. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, I did move. I just needed anything to help out. I just came back on because I ended my live abruptly. <laughs> anything helps to go towards any groceries between now and Friday when I get my check. I'm not doing a delivery. I'm not doing a pickup because I can't do a pickup because I have no way to do it. I'm not doing a delivery because I'm not giving out my address. So if that's the only option, you can keep scrolling on, okay? That's all I can do. <laughs> It's not red flags, it's called wanting to protect my privacy because I don't want anybody to know where I live. I don't want people knowing my phone number. I don't want, I'm sorry I don't have a car to go pick up any place that you guys want to deliver to, okay? Half of you offering the delivery or offering a pickup order have no intentions on doing it. You just want to know more information and be all hyped up. I've watched a little anti-scamming lives. This is what you guys do. You redirect everything and you start piling on the bullshit. So just move on. Get the fuck out of my life. I can't help it. Shack stackless. I've been waiting on my check for quite some time. Taylor, I'm going to be stopping at the grocery store while I'm out tomorrow. And I've already said, I'm not denying individual people. I'm telling you, I am, can't do a delivery because I'm not giving out my address. I cannot do a pickup because I do not have a vehicle. So sorry. I'll take a gift card. Give me a gift card for Hannaford and Sanford, Maine. I will take a freaking gift card over giving you guys my information. I need a charger. I need to blow my nose. I don't want a pickup order. I can't do a pickup order. I will take a gift card for Hannaford. I, I'm not doing a pre-order. I want to get my own items, okay? I'm not comfortable with somebody else buying my tampons and my pads, okay? The government messed up big time. I will take a gift card for Hannaford. I am not giving you my information. Sorry. Where are my parents? My dad has passed away. Not only that, but I've learned my lesson. When somebody says, I'm going to do an order for you, I've never had somebody follow through and do it. I'm sorry. I do have Venmo. It's in my bio, but I can give it to you right here, too. Jen. I've had a lot of people just not even come through for me. I can't. Sorry if cash is the only thing that I can trust. Um, I haven't gotten $20 yet. I'm just getting pennies right now. Telling me, get a job, bro. That I'm lazy. That I'm a scamanda. I have needed anything helps. $20 more would make it so that I can get what I need. Let me go double check. I haven't seen anything come through. Why? Just why? Just fucking why? You look like a goddamn cartoon. I'm not just... Cr Thank you, French Fry, so much. Oh, my God. My disability is I'm in remission for bone cancer.
the why those jump through. Of course I need this money. Um, Nanny Goat. I'm only going to say this one time in here. I 1.5 stopped back in 2015 when I crashed my car. It was the last day that I took opiates or any pills. So kindly move along. Thank you. Great. I know you can. That's why I'm telling you. Did she really have a history? I've never had a hysterectomy. I don't know who told you I had a hysterectomy because I got all my goods. Why are people in here? I Yes, I've needed help. I'm sorry I've needed help, but I went to go check my... Okay. And I'm going to say one more thing. For the people who want to suggest that this is for other items, it's because you guys are diverted because you apparently have that issue. And if you have that issue, I suggest you get help, okay? I don't have to do it. I've been in remission for five years. I'm, I'm not letting anyone in the box. Yes, I do have an Amazon wish. Oh, thank you for that French fry. That's awesome. And I'm not crying because I'm not getting money. I'm just going to ignore that person from now on because it's not worth my time. Okay, Melanie... If I wanted to lie about my life, I would make it more lavished. I am, like, worried sick about my appointment tomorrow, and I have people just being so mean. <laughs> yes, I know, and that's why. Stella, because just the normal bullies just being horrible. Yes, Cam, I did. Thank you so much. I got $2 and $5. It's going to help a lot. Melissa, I can't work because I'm in remission for bone cancer. I have a hole in my hip and a hole in my pelvis. Gabby. Okay. Carrie. Juanita, I'm crying because people just, they know what buttons to push. Lisa, I get $15 in food stamps. Um, Susan Connor did not send me $20. <laughs> no, they do, because in fact, my, my CA is right here, if anyone's able to help, and my PayPal and Venmo are my bio. And I'm going to work. I only came back on because I see three. That's correct, Bella. I filled out plenty of those forms. <laughs> it's just astonishing, some of these people out here. It's like I came back on because I ended my live abruptly. And I came back on saying whatever else I could get was great. I appreciate it. If I had the materials, Lauren, to bake, I would. But I don't. And Liam, of course you do. Of course you do, darling. Of course you do. Because this is a tactic that a lot of these anti-scam sites use, is they will have their people flock in their little cult, and I just got $2 and $5, and they'll have the little cult members come in and post a spam the hell out of the chat and make it look horrendous. Have you what? Have you...
Jennifer Christensen, yes. I am going to, I'm, well, I'm going to obviously catch up, but the pantry is, I can't get to the pantry tomorrow because I have my appointment. I do have an Amazon list, and Janelle, I'm crying because people want to bully. People want to send me messages calling me Scamanda, calling me really horrendous names. I just got one telling me to unalive myself that I belong deceased. That's why I'm crying. Has nothing to do with, oh, you guys figured me out. The list should be in my bio. Everyone's telling me it's not, so I'm going to. I'm from Maine. It is. It's horrible. Then they want to come in the chat and they want to say, oh, it's because we're... We're calling her out. No, dude. There's nothing to call me out, but if you're going to tell me I should unalive myself, that's fucked the fuck up. <laughs> Roberta, because I had an investigation. They froze my check. I'm getting my check on Friday, but the other two checks, I'm just waiting. They're, they're out in freaking Social Security land. I've trusted too many people. I've learned too much. Sorry. Thank you for the $5. It does help so much. Everything helps. Mrs. Hersey, because I am in remission for bone cancer. I have a hole in my hip and a hole in my pelvis. I'm not able to reschedule this appointment. It's put in as... They have to see me Monday morning. I mean, that's... The appointment's all set. I don't... The little tree? Thank you. Uh, people sending me bad messages? I can tell you who they are. Jay Lee Knight is one of them, and Jason Farnham is the other one. Lisa Hayes, thank you for confirming that. People just don't want to believe me. Go check my Facebook. Why? My Facebook is a whole lot of nothing, because I don't use Facebook. Weirdos, dude. Bunch of fucking weirdos. Another reason why I don't give out my personal information because people then go and attack my freaking mother who's 75 years old. Lisa Hayes, they told me the same thing. They told me it was going to be within two weeks of October 30th. Still haven't seen shit. Hi, Kathy, how are you? Um, UHC, I don't know what you mean by that. Exactly, Lisa. I mean, she's verifying that I am not bogus about this one. Amber, I'm just trying to get whatever help I can to get groceries and personal care items tomorrow when I go to my doctor's appointment and find out my results for my scan. The tears aren't. It's not about getting what I want. It's nobody should be sent messages like what I'm receiving. This Shaylee person can leave. This Jason person can leave. No, it's just a little tabletop tree that I've had for years. Mimi, maybe you weren't in here earlier, so I'm not going to get mad at you or anything, but you have to have a 48-hour business notice, and I didn't have that. Thank you, Melanie. I do appreciate it. 
The messages are just horrible. They're mean. They're just mean. Well, then Shaylee needs to go away because... And some Jason Farnham. I mean, I would never, ever... Like, even if the person was doing so wrong... It's like they provoke like they're children. Oh, thank you, Carissa. I, I've learned to have very bad trust issues. I don't trust anyone anymore. I have trusted somebody on this app to give me a ride. They gave me a ride to a store. This is when I was living out of town. They gave me a ride in town and left me stranded and then ignored my phone calls. I was stranded out in the rain. I trusted somebody that was going to do a grocery call, which I was grateful that they were going to do it. So grateful. They never did it. I ended up thinking, okay, I'm all set. I'm good. I ended up managing a way to go and pick up the groceries. They never called in an order. I gave my phone number to somebody to pay my phone bill online. They ended up taking my phone number and posting it. I got so many prank calls. I can't trust anybody on here. I'm sorry. Rose, I don't think anybody's obligated. I am grateful. I'm being so honest. Why would I lie about this life? Exactly, Eddie. Not one of them. I've gotten so much hate mail telling me you weren't on live cooking on Thanksgiving. You're a liar. You never went online. You never did this. Yeah, I did. I had two lives on Thanksgiving. And then luckily, I had an amazing person go on and verify. Yeah, she was definitely online cooking. It was great. It was a great live. Thank you, Carissa. Bubbles, please do not sit here and make me validate my period. I am 43 years old. I do have a period. Just because my mother is 75, it has nothing to do with my periods. Make that make sense. Oh, thank you, Joanne. I should get a P.O. box. That way I can't. Right. I mean, people can have babies at 44. What does that mean? Exactly. I had a great life. A great life. Bubbles, I don't understand what you're trying to say, honey. Melissa, here, let me help you. Now you don't have to worry about anything. I'm sorry. Uh, you better get some help for that, KK. Oh, thank you, Jesse Lee. I'm glad I helped you on Thanksgiving. I, I thought we had fun on Thanksgiving, like... Yeah, KK, I would get some help for that, honey. That can be bad. It can be quite uncomfortable, too. Oh, I think Bubbles is just talking out her butt. I don't know why that's pinned, actually. I mean, yeast infections can be the worst. <laughs> Thank you for the five dollars. Like I said, anything goes towards what I need until Friday, and you know it's all. I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful.
But yeah, I just wanted to come back on. I mean, I didn't even... You know what? No, it's, um... Actually, it's not. It was $12. But anything is going to help. Whether I go over or under... I'll... You know, I'm grateful for whatever I do get. Um, Miss Terry, it doesn't matter either way because I can't even get there to go to the curb. Anything helps, Caitlin. Anything helps. I mean, as we all know, $40 doesn't go very far. Damn, $60 doesn't go very far. Nothing goes very far in this world anymore. If you did, Susie, I mean, that's, I'm so grateful. I mean, everything is so expensive. I mean, I've been even stressing this so bad because you know, I'm guaranteed to get one check on Friday, $920, and then they're cutting my checks and I'm going to get under $900 because they're making me pay for my own Medicare B. So now I don't know what to do. Check my Venmo. Okay, I will. Patty, maybe it doesn't send red flags because they can see the common sense of if you've already been screwed over by giving out your personal information, a person doesn't want to go through that again. I have to pay to have my phone number changed. Do you realize that? But I mean, I haven't seen anything come through yet. Uh, why did I... I did, did that by accident, sorry. All right. I mean, people are willing to go out there and make more. I, I don't get it. I don't get it. I just don't understand people and their mentality. Um, because, Jade, they're no longer going to pay for my Medicare Part B. I just got the notice yesterday. Um... So now I have to pay for my own Medicare Part B. I need to call them tomorrow about that. And they said that I'm going to get less. You know, they gave me my amount, so I'm going to be getting. I do have Chime. Let me give it to you right here. Dior, that's my Chime right there. Really? Oh my gosh, Carrie, don't even tell me that because I cannot afford shit like that. Oh my gosh, April. Yes, that's my Charlie Brown Christmas tree. I was trying to get in the Christmas spirit. Um, all right, let me go double check. Did Caitlin get blocked or something? Is that why you're bringing this out to my attention or are you just trying to put it out there? I'm, I'm seriously not seeing anything from a Caitlyn. I'm not even joking. What did she send it on?
for it. I don't have much to decorate with. But I really haven't seen anything come through from Caitlyn. I'm sorry. That's okay, Melanie. You know, Lisa, I did move. And go look it up on Google. I'm sure my Shapley address is posted there somewhere. I mean, these places are pretty generic. I mean, there's white walls. And I can even show you guys my lease, okay? So, actually, no. I, Amanda, no. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Don't have to. I don't know what you're talking about, hysterectomy. I did move, Lisa. I don't know why you're saying I'll... To... I mean, do I know you? Are you, like, a friend? Thank you, Shelby. I tried to get in. Well, no, I haven't gotten any more... Or, Traka C50. I haven't gotten any more, you know, messages telling me to unalive myself. So, I'm trying, starting to regroup a little bit, Okay. Oh, Danielle. Thank you, Danielle. I'm like, where the hell is this hysterectomy coming from? I still got all my shit. Tamney, you shouldn't have. I've never... Yeah, I'm not showing them shit, Deb. Thank you. <laughs> Jeez, people are crazy. I did post the chime. I'll post it one more time. Oh, look, I just rhymed. <laughs> I just rhymed twice. There you go, Diore. Oh, people are reporting it. Probably. I'll just end up getting another email and then they'll say, okay, you're good, and it'll all pass. It doesn't do anything. I don't care what videos are up. I mean, I did a mistake by even trying to see it. I need to go back to my I don't care what people think about me or say about me. I get Social Security, Ms. Terry, and it's actually, I get it on Friday. I haven't had a check since September, but divorce attorney, I can answer for myself. Thank you very much. I haven't gotten a check since September because it was on hold. Somebody just verified it just happened to them, too. They told me I'd have my check within two weeks of October 30th, and I still haven't gotten it. It took them four weeks, or months, I don't remember. Thank you, Tammy. Because she got reported. That's right, Kimmy sucks. No, my name doesn't start with F. Kales, um, I've already addressed that. My situation in the future is going to be fine. I get my check on Friday. That starts back up regularly. So, yeah. Um, B-O-X-O, there's really no goal. Anything helps to get me through until Friday. Um, it was in... Did you get... To, yes, I did, Susan. Thank you very much. So I was just told that I'm awfully bitchy for a bigger. I don't think I'm bitchy. I think I'm very grateful. Why? Because I block people. Um, the giving cabinet, I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. Somebody just verified. It just happened to them also. Um, I just had her comment pended. And... Pended. Sorry, I just totally cracked on that one. But I just had her comment pen, pinned. And she said that... 
they told her two weeks from the closeout date, and then it ended up being like four months. So I don't know when I'm going to get it. Um, Caitlin, was it under... I literally just got it. When people were telling me that you sent it, I really hadn't gotten it yet. It just came through. And I should be great. I should be all fabulous. Um, user, you'll have to tell me what your what was blocked because I don't know that they shouldn't have been blocking and I've gotten rid of them since. They're making me look stupid. But thank you very much, Kaylin. I'm very grateful to you. Thank you. I mean, that's going to go a long way for real. But nobody, I don't block people who send. I had somebody. Life with four. I had somebody that was in here blocking the shit out of people that were being nice, blocking the people that were sending gifts or donations. They were blocking people. For the wrong reasons. So if people were blocked. Please let me know. Your main account. I did Caitlin. Thank you very 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 much. I did Caitlin. Thank you very 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 much. Um, I, let me take a screenshot of this. User, if you're going to tell me whatever was blocked, let me know. But if you're not, then apparently it wasn't too important. Oh, yeah, I know, Caramel. I know, and I've gotten rid of them. Kelly Kell. Bernie, I'm learning that very slowly. Lucifer. Oh, that sounds bad. Yes, and I'm going to do that. Can you go by just their name and unblock it, or do you have to go through the whole list? Yeah, Kelly, I remember, and you helped me out, too. Yeah, you never should have gotten blocked for defending me. That's for real. Yeah, Kelly, Kelly, you definitely shouldn't have been blocked, because I remember you. Yeah, I don't block anybody. Just to let anybody know for the future, nobody gets blocked if you sent... Or kindness is free. If you've helped me out, if you have been kind, there's no reason for you to be blocked. The only reason that you would have been blocked up until this point was because I had somebody who was doing it on purpose. Mindy was okay, Kay. Thank you. I'm gonna address this when I get off in a few minutes, and yeah, because nobody should be blocked. I want to keep all the positive people. Donna, you don't have to be here, okay? Thank you, Cam. <laughs> yeah, I don't usually. No, I actually become friends with. Some people who have sent to me. I mean, there's a couple of people that I talk to on the daily through text messaging, you know, and yeah. So it's not like me to even block people like that. I block you if you're being hateful to either me or someone in the chat. I block you if you're bullying somebody in the chat or me. I block you if you're being obnoxiously weird. You know, I block for good reasons. I don't block just for shits and giggles. That's not how I, op like, do things, sorry. Yeah. 
It doesn't always happen, and it won't happen. Yes, Caitlin, you are very kind, and I do appreciate it. Yeah, Kelly, I do remember you specifically, so yeah. Yeah, Melanie. The only reason that's happening is because, again, a little Ku Klux Klan out there for anti-scammers did this thing of Amanda blocked all of her gifters after they send. Hi, Joanna. Welcome. After they send. And so now I think one of the people that I had mod in for me was part of that little clan. They weaseled their way in, and they were blocking people that were blessing me, and I'm blocking people that were hating me. Thank you very much, Charlotte, and please, around 10 o'clock in the morning, be praying for me, or 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, depending on where you are. Yep, do your research. Go get an encyclopedia. Snoots, I'm hearing you. It's hard. Heather, it was just a joke. Yes, Tammy, I did. Thank you very much. I didn't see you in here anymore, so I didn't say anything. And I don't usually say the names of the gifters. So, thank you, Deb. Prayers are amazing. I do love the prayers. Do you know she's lying? Do you live with her? Oh, thank you, Caitlin. I appreciate that. I don't have any family. or I've gotten rid of... Okay, thank you, Kel. But yeah, I don't have... I'll unblock those other two accounts. Thank you, Leslie. Tammy, your kindness is free. You know, your kindness is a blessing. I appreciate that more than anything. Thank you, Paula. Renee, not if it's your last, because I'm good now. Yes, I agree with you. Tomorrow, I've been called in. I had a scan done on Friday, and they called me. An on-call doctor called me, and I have to go in first thing Monday morning for the results. Oh, it's so stressful, and that's originally why I came on here. This time, it's just to talk because I'm stressing in my head, you know? And then I just got attacked. It was like, holy crap. Normally, I can repel the haters. Usually, I can dish it back with, like, you know, and try to be funny. But it's hard to be funny when your brain is crazy. Yeah, I, I have enough to make do with what I need. But thank you so much. Thank you, Tammy. But yeah, I haven't been called back for one of my scans. I get a scan every six months, and I have never been called back for one of my scans until now. So, it just makes you think a lot, you know? Thank you. I will, Dorinda. I will be on here. I'm going to try to come on on my way home on the bus because I can't do it in the taxi, so. Oh, Joanna. Well, if you need someone to talk to, I'm here. God is good all the time. That's what my mother-in-law's license plate used to say. Thank you, Dorinda. Yes, I'm actually going to get off shortly. I'm going to go and go to bed. Thank you, Misty. Larry, just go away. I never would and never have. All set, dude. Breezy, I haven't taken pills since 2000. Thank you for that. That was cute. I love that. That was so cute. Because Larry doesn't have an identity, sweetie. Thank you. Prayers are amazing. But yeah, I'm going to get off here. I need to go take a shower. The ghost was amazing. I love that. It was adorable. But I'm going to go take a shower and try to get some sleep. 
I can cash out my TikTok gifts on Wednesday. That's right. Larry is a secret investigator for one of the clans. Oh, Joanne, I'm so sorry to hear that. I was homeless for three years till I was blessed. I was on a waiting list for housing, and I finally, after three years. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Of course you did, Kaylin. I'm so sorry. That's why I don't say the names, because you'll be bullied. You're going to have messages coming to you. The only advice I can give you is ignore them. Report and ignore. And I'm so sorry. That's why I don't give out the names. I'm so, so sorry, Caitlin. That's pretty shitty. Yeah, they basically are trying to make people afraid because people literally get attacked for helping me. It's stupid. Just make sure you report Whoever's account, whatever video. Oh, Cam. Yeah, maybe you should shut your messages off. I mean, that I my hormones are all over the place right now. I wish it was postpartum. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Apparently, they're, like, all really... I think they love me. I think they're infatuated with me. They give me a lot of attention. Oh, Tiffany, I'm so sorry. People are crazy. I just think they're in love with me and I won't give them a time of day. And that's cool. That's cool. Fan club, I guess. And what's really crazy about all that, real quick, they all have me blocked. I can't see none of the shit that they post about me. So I can't even defend myself. I did. Thank you. It only takes one person to make a, don't say my name because I'm getting bullied. Yeah, absolutely, Caitlin. That's why I don't say anybody's name, just because they will get bullied. And it's heartbreaking that they will do this to people who help other people. I mean, they basically just want to shit on people that are down. Um, Bane, I don't, like I said, I had a mod in here. Oh, I reached my goal. Thank you, whoever did that. I just noticed, and I feel really, really bad. Nobody deserves that. Nobody does. But all right, guys, thank you for the ones that helped me. Again, I don't say your name because I don't want that happening, like what's happening to Caitlin. Um... Okay, I will, simply. Thank you so much. I'm telling you, somebody just hates me. I really thought they were just in love with me and infatuated with me, but I won't give them the time of day. But all right, guys, good night, and I am good, Nash. Thank you. Unblock you, too. Okay, message me if you guys are wrong or if you think that you're wrongfully blocked. Yeah, I can see your comments, Luke. But alright, I appreciate you guys. Good night. And I will let you guys know and pray tomorrow, okay?